Welcome back, survivors. Disturb Z here. And we are back in subsistence. Alright, guys. Let's see. Time to do a little kelp diving. Here's a little bit more. So anyway, guys, read your comments. A few of y'all seem to want me to dabble with the lights underwater to see what happens. So I am willing to check it out, guys. But first, we have got to see if we can get some more electronics. Because that will be the key if we don't die because we forgot about oxygen. Yes, that does happen. Every once in a while, you just forget that you need it. Get a little bit of kelp here, and we'll throw it in the chicken coop. And we'll go from there. Come on. There we go. Let's see, yeah, that should probably just about fill it up. 94%. Good enough. Good enough. Alright, so let me go ahead and turn this light off. Oh, by the way, our cotton plants grew last night, so I was able to harvest them. And we got another set of... Uh, tomatoes planted I had to use one tomato to make a seed so that I'd have a full plant bed but we did it we got it completely full of fertilizer they're good let's go out and find some stuff guys wow really y'all were like waiting there in ambush on me or something it's okay that is okay <laughs> these wolves I was running around last night trying to see if I could find boxes and stuff and oh these wolves were everywhere it was just a bit ridiculous Oh, you know what? I was going to shoot him with arrows, and I just remembered my arrows are back in the table. Because we have to craft them in the table, so I left them in the stinking table. Oh, come on, Wolfie. You might as well come die. <clears throat> Wolfie and a bear. Wow. Wow. This is going to be fun. Um, okay. I wonder if he's damaging that at all. Wow, he can damage a metal structure. I'm not quite sure I agree with that. Yes, grizzly bears are extremely strong, but... That's, you know... That's not a, an aluminum can he's hitting on there. Although it's acting like it is. Either way, either way, we'll go ahead and grab this fat. I need to get some berries and stuff anyway, so. Not too big of a deal. And one more. Yeah, that ought to do me good. 
Okay. So. Now that I got seven premium arrows left. Everything should be all good. Maybe. Hopefully. Yep. Everything's good in the fridge. Now, I was told we could use the, uh, the livers to make antidotes even after they spoil. So, I'm going to test it out. I'm going to put this liver in here, and I'm going to let it spoil today. Hopefully, it'll spoil today. And we will see if we can make an antidote. Because if we can, awesome. If we can't, no big deal. We got so many livers in the fridge anyway, it's just, yeah. <laughs> Losing one ain't gonna hurt nothing. Not at all. Alright, now I distinctly remember there was a bag over here somewhere that I'd like to go back to, if possible... Other than the fact that I think that wolf is probably standing right next to it. So let's go up here and take a look. That wolf is literally standing next to that bag. Oh look, here's another bag with another wolf at it. <sighs> Seriously people? I think I won't. Do not ever run up on me, Mr. Wolf. I will slay you in a heartbeat. Especially with my high dollar arrows. Okay, now I'm going to go get this bag. Thank you. And where did that other bag go? Oh, is he down the hill? Haha, <laughs> he missed me. Gonna just lead them on a little chase. Hey, there's a bag right there. All right, bet you feel stupid. Wolf hunting 101. Premium arrows are a must. They make it so much easier. Now, let's see what kind of goodies are in here since it uh, took me so long to get to. Could have been a better bag. Could have been a lot better, but I'm not complaining. Where did that... Could have swore I saw an ammo bag when I ran up here. Rabbit, you're lucky. Really? The ammo bag despawned? Surely not. Or am I just looking in the wrong spot? No, I think it despawned. Hmm. Okay, well. That sucks, but it'll be alright. It will be alright. We're going to try to avoid that bear. Oh, there's another bear. The animals are so thick. OK. 
Okay. Bags, bags, bags. Where are all the bags? I need electronics, people. I want to test out the lights. tell you what the one day I, I'm like we got a set goal it's you know within reason accomp accomplishable and what happens nothing zinc I got a ton of it oh and I just want to thank everybody for letting me know about the extra um, power efficiency option in the refinery I did see it earlier I didn't realize I had to scroll just kind of overlooked it so I do appreciate everybody pointing that out for me Because after y'all said something, I vaguely remember that I had seen that before in a previous uh, season. I just completely zoned out, spaced out, whatever you want to call it. So I didn't see it. So thank you guys. I was thinking about that because I remember I set like a stack of 50 potassium in there to uh refine today while we were running around looking for our electronics since we're out of copper and iron in the refinery i figured gunpowder's the next best thing so we're going with potassium let's go ahead and make cordage up i guess decent little amount there it's not like we're running short on cordage not now anyway cordage is usually the uh, early game struggle now we just have so much of it it's ridiculous Still not seeing any bags. Where are all the bags? Seriously, this is ridiculous. try up here and find some just maybe and just maybe no a bit ridiculous okay seriously I'm getting annoyed at this point where it was 
<sighs> Guess who found the lockbox without a lockpick on him? Yay, me. We're smart. <laughs> okay, well, it's up here on that rock. We might just have to go get a lockpick and come back for it. That might be the best thing to do. You gotta be prepared. We're in kitty territory. So this is where all the bags are gonna be hiding. Is up here. Yay, an electronic. Yay, another bag. Yep, just went to the wrong side of the map today, I guess. I went to the right when I should have went to the left. Alright. Let's get us a lockpick real quick. And at the same time, I'm going to throw this and this in there. Running around with kind of a, an assortment of goodies on us. We might want to be careful. Lockpick. I need boards. Boards, a little bit of scrap. Make it up. Good, good, good. All right. I'll put that away. Let's go ahead and eat one of these apples. Put that away, that away, that, that, that. I'm going to go ahead and toss those in there for now. That seems good. Don't want to lose that electronic. There's some scrap. See? Increased power efficiency. I founded it. Let's toss that in there. And add that on top of all the zinc. Nice, nice, nice. All right. Let's see now. There's a bag. anymore okay we do got our lock pick had to double check I know we just grabbed it but I had just a bit of a brain fart there okay well oh why I missed pretty good health let's just ride it out shall we thinking the upgraded shotgun is nice very nice we got to get that third level though okay come on stop bleeding any second now oh don't run to the bear or to the wolves. Not good. OK. 
Okay, now that lockbox was right here, I thought. Am I on the wrong rock? Oh, there it is. Stupid wolves. Really? Nope, you would be able to figure out your way up, wouldn't you? y'all not to run up on me. Decimating the wolf population today. Three of those little suckers we had to kill. Oh yeah. You know that will give us five electronics. I wonder if that's enough for the light. It very well could be. It very well could be, guys. Nope, time to run. He's right there too. Go run. He's gonna eat us. Haha, -ha, we made it. Taking four of you out will not hurt my feelings at all. That's what I thought, punk. Alrighty then. Let's get back and see if we can't do something with a light. What does it take for a light? Floodlight is... Where is the floodlight? Did I miss it? No, floodlight. There it is. We need a little bit of mass and some electronics. I think we have enough electronics. That gives us six. Did we need six or was it seven that we needed? No, we got enough. We just need a little bit of mass. So how much mass are we at? We are at 54. Okay. Um... No, render. Let's go ahead and cook these. And we'll cook a liver, why not? Running out of storage space. <laughs> Those still haven't spoiled.
Wrong one. This one. You know what? Let's just split that. Toss that in there. Nice. Building the floodlight. And I think... I'm going to go ahead and do that. Oh, we need to toss things in there. Those. That was a lot of protein bars we just got. That's awesome. Oh, speaking of which, I better feed the animals before they die. Ah, that was a close one. I almost forgot, guys. Almost. Okay. Nice. That is nice. And because of all the seeds we found, we have extras. Awesome. That is awesome, guys. burnt them just a bit yep just a little bit crispy mmm burnt steak alright got that let's see I bet I'm gonna need Probably going to need a wall to hang it on, so... Yeah, full wall will be fine. Oh yeah, we're getting our sinew built up. Alright guys, let's hop in the water and check this out, shall we? Okay, uh, I need this one. Okay. There we go. So the lights will turn on underwater. I wonder, let's let it get a little bit darker. And we will test this out. Alright guys, I'm going to pause it right here. That way the video doesn't run too long. Give me a second and we'll be right back. Alright guys, it is pretty dark out. And as you can see, the light is still on. Shining in the water. I'm going to jump in over here and swim around just to see the difference. Okay, this is dark, regular, unlit water. And yes, the lights do work underwater. I can see. I can collect. Let 
That is pretty cool. Now, can I... Let me try something here. Okay. So that's what it looks like underwater. Come on, let me... Let me up right here, dude. Fine, we'll just do it this way. Okay, lights up. Light is on. And it does the same thing. It pretty much illuminates. Mm, maybe not as good as it would if it was underwater. But, yeah. There you have it, guys. That is what a light will do through the water and in the water. So, that'll do it for today's video. I do hope everybody has enjoyed it. If you have, guys, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button. It's an awesome way for you to show your support to me, to the channel, to the video, and to the game itself, guys. And as always, feel free to share the video on any social media you're using. And guys, I'd just like to stop, take a moment to thank each and every one of y'all for all of your wonderful, awesome support, all the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared, guys. It is awesome. I do appreciate it. And with that being said, until next time, survivors, keep on surviving.